you do not have to have a lot of space to do paparazzi. This is my spare bedroom. Y'all, I started in my dining room with a bookshelf and my table. That's it, okay? And I have grown. So this is my spare bedroom. When you first come in, I've got... Now, everybody does it different. You guys know this. So, But this is the way I'm doing it right now. This could change. I have this 40 um, pair shoe rack, mesh shoe rack over my door and that's where I put my orders. I have these little clips that I got from the Dollar Tree and I have them numbered, but see little, they're just little mesh pockets. I like the fact that I can see through them and I like the fact that there's 40 of them and I can just stick them in there and I'll show you how I keep up with that in a minute. Now, nobody's jewelry room is ever clean. So I did not clean this up, you guys. It's This is how it usually is, okay? I have a TV and a refrigerator in here. And this is a little project I'm working on just for, to show my bags when I go to an event soon. I got a bling bag there. Okay, my closet. And then I have this nice shoe shelf here and I've got all my bins. Okay, I have an extra piece of pegboard there and a yard sign there. Look, I got all these little things from the Dollar Tree. I'm gonna show you how I use those and uh, let's see what else, what else, what else? I got all my bins up here. Okay, this doesn't always look like this, but there's my new pieces where I put my new pieces, album pieces, lanyards, rings. I've got everything numbered. My earrings are in green, and now I have them by number instead of color. I'm just now transitioning to that. So I have three bins of earrings all numbered. Now that's just for my overstock or my bags. Like for example, this um, E101 right here, you see it has nothing in it except the bag. So if I sell the one piece that I have left, I'm gonna pull this um, baggie out to put it in for shipping. And then I know I can use that number again, if that makes sense. Hair clips, Starlet Shimmer. Um, I got clip-ons separately. The orange is my short necklaces. The red is my long necklaces, and the blue is my bracelets. I have not done them by number yet. They're my last ones to do. So I used to have everything done um, by color. So that's why those are still in color. I have men on the bottom, bulk down here. Now in the beginning, I had bought these two um, shelves here with the little bins you can put on it. So that's where I put, you know, certain supplies. I have some baggies and some labels. I have my um, hostess rewards there, bags, just whatever, you know. I even have the little bubble wrap that I get in the boxes down here. So no way is wrong, no way is better than the other. My sister bought me that for my 40th birthday. Okay, we're gonna move on. I've got one ring light here. This is a window. So, you know, sometimes when I can use the actual daylight, I just go ahead and do that because it's better. I got this little thingy right here. This little um, rollable tray, whatever you wanna call that. I got that at five below for five bucks. So yeah, that's great. I play bingo a lot. And then I have all my receipts there and I'm gonna show you how I do those. I've got a tray on my desk. This is me getting ready for an event. So I made these two, so they're just sitting here um, right now. I do make sheets that I'll show you guys that um, I do. So like when I order stuff, I've made this, uh, let's see if I can get you guys to see it. I've made this sheet. I'm gonna turn around up here so you can see it because I don't put actual names and stuff on there, but this is a sheet I make to help me keep up with stuff. And I just staple it on top of my invoice when it comes in. And I'll show you how I do that. All these down here on the bottom are done. All these up here, they still need to be put in my, in my system. I've got some jewelry unopened back here, some new pieces I gotta show live tonight. I gotta get all that together. Some of my numbers, there's my tripod. Um, I just got a calendar sitting up here. I'm just gonna kind of show you a few things that I have. If you have any questions, you can just um, leave them in the comments. I do get these receipt books at uh, the Dollar General because I like to use those for my sales. And um, here's my desk, here's my desk. I've got some boxes saved under there, trash cans, some more supplies. 
On this side, I've got um, my motor, my scale right there, uh, my labels. Now, I want you guys to see this. On top, I have unpaid, unpaid, hold, and paid. Okay, so anything that's in the paid box, I know I need to ship. Um, and anything that's unpaid, I know is unpaid. But what I do is... I got lucky and this bar back here is magnetic and I don't want to go real fast over, I mean real slow over those names because some of them do have the last names on them. So I'll do a close up of one that doesn't have the names on it. But what I do is every time a piece is ordered, then I put it, um, I, I, I put it on a ticket. Okay. So for instance, let's just do Paula Kay. Paula Kay, I put her name up there and her, um, piece that she's ordered so far is the kiss up yellow for this week and the number on the top is the band that i put it in over here okay so that's how that works and then the date i invoice once a week so that's my invoice date so i know how that works now what happens is uh, when i'm ready to um invoice then i take uh, all those down and uh, I get them together and I make sure that everything is put into my system and that everything, everybody's baggies uh, match what's on there. I have my long necklaces and a couple of twirl ties. Now, this is a Murphy bed in this bedroom, guys. It is a Murphy bed. So I just pushed it up and then I have the rest of the space. I actually use it sometimes, the bed. It folds right down and um, I can move my boards. These are some of the boards that I have. I can move them out of the way and bring that bed down. And that's why I have that TV and stuff in here because I have my nieces um, sometimes. So these are my boards I'm gonna use for an event and I try to keep stuff up. I've got stuff on both sides. Here's my rings here. Those are my long necklaces. I've got some short necklaces, my earrings. And then on this side, I have my hair clips and some starlet shimmer. So I'm just gonna, and there's a shelf built in on this side. I just put some of my stuff over here. Um, these are my, some of my bags. So when I get ready to pull stuff, I just grab the ticket and I use a paper clip. I mean, a clothespin, I have them down here in storage. I clothespin their receipt or their ticket on and I pull the stuff out of their bin and put it in here. And then when I get all those together, I take them to my desk. Now, if they're a pickup and I'm not going to be shipping it like this one right here, I'll just sit it over here. For example, I've got this one from Robin T. That means if the, the receipt's on it, she hasn't paid. If there's no receipt on it, it has a name on it, it's paid and it's ready to either be picked up or delivered. Like that one right there is a coworker, so I'll be delivering that one. And that one up there is my mom's, the big one. So um, she'll be able to get that one ever. But I'm going to show you just kind of a over cap of the room that I use right now. Hopefully this will be changing soon, but I'm just here to show you, you don't have to have a big space. You do not have to have, everybody wants a big space. I get that. Everybody wants a big space, but you don't have to have one um, at first. So anyways, if you have any questions, just drop them in the comments. Make sure that you subscribe and I'll try to do more videos. Talk to y'all later.